61A lecture number 15, Announcements. Tonight there will be an extra lecture in A1 Hearst Annex starting at 6.30 p.m. on containers. Lists are containers, dictionaries are containers. Could you implement these things without having them built into the language? We'll see how. And also work through an interesting example on building constraint networks. Homework 5 is due on Wednesday. It's really long, one of the longest in the whole course and that's because it covers multiple important topics. You should really spend time on this homework. Even though homework is graded on effort, if you blow this one off, you'll have a hard time catching up in the course. So make sure you spend enough time to rever review the recent material and understand what's going on so that you can answer these questions. You should start now. And if you have questions that come up, you can come to lab this week, and after finishing the lab assignment, or as much as you want, you can start asking questions of the lab assistants and uh, rest of the course staff that's in the room in lab. You could also come to office hours before the time right before the deadline. I know there's a lot of crowding in office hours these days. We're working hard to staff it so that there will be enough people there to answer your questions in a timely manner, but you can help too. It's much less crowded at 11 or 12 than it is at 4 or 5 p.m. If you're still not done in the evening, we're going to have a homework party on Wednesday from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. run by the course tutors. Quiz 2 will be released on Wednesday. It's due on Friday, but I expect you to finish it on Thursday so that you can spend Friday doing whatever you do on Fridays. Quizzes, as you may recall, exist to make sure that you're able to answer the kinds of questions that are important in this class. They have the same format as the homework, the problems tend to be a little bit less involved, but you do have to solve them on your own without assistance from your peers or the course staff. Project 3, ANTS, will be released shortly, and it's due next Thursday. It's one of the largest projects in the course, smaller only than Project 4, which is yet to come. So make sure you carve out lots of time to work on this project, the purpose of this project is to have you master the object system in Python, which we started discussing last Friday, and we'll finish most of the discussion today, so that you understand what are all these objects and classes and attributes, etc. Well, you'll put all that knowledge into practice on Project 3. And just so you have it on your calendar, be aware that Midterm 2 is coming up. Thursday the 22nd, the midterm will start at 7 p.m.